So I see at the Raw Till 4 Thai Festival, real food, real fun, real people, best fruit quality ever. Where is it, Freely? When is it? It's in Chiang Mai, Thailand, July 1st to July 15th. See you on the Facebook group. We'll see you there. See you there. I've got a question today. Thoughts Freely and Dorado Avocado. It's a humble little avo. Freely, can you share for one minute what's your experience with the avocado? Oh, you go first. I'll go first. I'm still editing. All right. Avocados. I've become a bit of a fruit snob in the last few years. I've traveled around the world as a bit of a fruitarian, fruit addict, fructose guzzler, and I've had such high quality fruits. Once you get a taste for something of high quality, and then you go back to what, you know, sort of average, I find it really hard personally to enjoy my food. I've had some of the best avocados on the planet in my opinion, on my friend Clinton's farm up in Mariba, Queensland. A shepherd seedling tree ripened avocado that's fallen to the ground. It's even maybe got a little bit of a bite from a fruit bat or a possum out of it. And you cut that bad boy open and it is just incredible. Every other avocado I eat outside of that tastes like soap. So I enjoy avocados. If I could get that quality every single day, would I eat it? I wouldn't because I find avocados take me. I like to eat a lot of food and having half an avocado an avocado a day yeah probably I like to eat a lot I don't like restricting so for me eating up as many avocados as I want I don't feel good next day I feel like it takes me longer in training to warm up um, I think avocados do have a place so if I was wanting to store a bit more body fat then yeah I'd add in some more avocado but the main reason I don't eat them is because A I can't get the taste the flavorful ones and B would be don't feel as good on them I prefer high carbohydrate things freely. Yeah, I don't feel as good either. I have like heavy legs the next day, and you know, I found since incorporating some cooked carbs, it's really easy to keep the diet like nine five five, five percent of calories from fat per day, and like avoid avocado because when I was one hundred percent raw, I was always going back to avocado. Yeah, like a lot putting it in these dressings and like these raw pastas, and I see so many all all the raw fooders who are doing 100% raw, which isn't many, but who go to avocado a lot. And it's not optimal, it's really not. We've been there. <laughs> We've been there, it just is not working. It doesn't work. And for me, I'm, I'm actually a lot leaner since not having avocado and overt fats mm. in my diet very much. You know, it's very minimal. And I've found I'm, I'm feeling better, looking better, performing better, so I don't see the point really. I'd rather eat chippies. I'd chips, rather potatoes. Eat chippies than have avocado pasta. Like, how, I'd rather have just real pasta. I mean, how unsatisfying is it to have zucchini spiralized with an avocado? Like, where are the carbohydrates? Where's the the feel good factor in that? Where's the glycogen restoration? I think, and that's fine. I think what you want to do is do the experiment. And if you feel better on avocado, then that's fine. We've done our experiment. We feel better on cooked starches or ideally fruits like bananas, mango, meringue, jackfruit, etc. But then avocado, you know, we eat it a few times a year, definitely. We definitely eat it a few times a year. I think we had it a few weeks ago when we went at sushi. Um, so a few times a year, we definitely ate avocado. Yeah, and I like avocado. I mean, I'm not writing avocado off, but I think people got to be got to get real with themselves when they think like avocado is you know some magical fruit or something it's great like in small amounts but how much is definitely debatable mm. i just like to eat as much as i want every meal and for me i keep my fats low i'd say i'll follow 95 5 style so much better truly you yeah. 80 10 10 or you 955 955 like 955 for the win I so. mean even when I was 100 percent raw like 955 felt way better than mm. 80 10 10 mm -hmm. but it was just so hard to like keep it 955 when being 100 percent raw so much easier now do you find it so much easier Harley incredibly easy incredibly easy so that's a little ramp avocados good or bad we're sort of more neutral find they found make our legs feel a bit heavy next day in training um, take the edge off things but hey if you can eat avocados and enjoy it eat some for us but i find they taste like soap because i can't get the quality ones and if i could don't feel as sharp as i do when i'm smashing carbohydrates be it corn rice fruits mangoes bananas dates etc really any, any last comments on our little avocado no that's it that's it Jordan Rider. 
All right, post your comments and questions down below. What's your experiences with the avocado? What's your favorite variety? My favorite variety is a shepherd seedling organic tree ripened, actually fallen to the ground, ripened up with a little bite from a little possum. Let me know it's ready. Post your comments down below. See you soon.